you remember I told you a story? Yeah. We go back in time to when Poland was invaded. The Polish people fought very valiantly, didn't they? Why did the Nazis, why were they able to invade so quickly? Yes. Well, because Poland is quite small compared to like Germany and the army. Yeah, the, the Polish army just wasn't as strong. Okay, so the Nazis came and the Gestapo, the secret police came and they were, they weren't just after the Jews. Were they? Although that was the main thing that they wanted. They also took away anyone who they thought would cause trouble. Who were some of the other people who they thought would cause trouble? If you had dark hair. Yes, definitely. That was one of the things they didn't like. So Slavs and Romanies they didn't like. But also, just people who they thought were going to cause trouble for them. Yes. Brownie scouts, cubs. Yes, so we're talking about scouts, definitely. And also, I was thinking of things like university lecturer. Yeah, were you going to say that anymore? Leaders. Leaders, yeah. The Nazis broke in and they took away the scout leaders and the scouts and even sometimes the cubs and the brownies. And what did they do to them? Yes, they would shoot them. They would shoot them. Yeah, they would. They would kill them. Our hero is a scout. Can anybody remember what his name was? If you can know, just shout it out now. Kazik. Right. And eventually, after being moved around lots of different prisons, Kazik and Alec are taken to a very famous prison, which is called what? Everybody say together. Auschwitz. Right. This is the worst part. These are the chimneys of the crematoriums where they would burn the bodies. Yes? This is the, in there is the execution wall. There's a gate that says Arbeit macht frei. He makes a friend, Jinek. And Jinek is a bit of an older man and he's a really, really good mechanic. And he's allowed to mend the Nazis' cars in the garages. Who can remind me of what happens after they've been in the prison for two years? One second, yes? They tried to escape. They tried to escape. Jinex had some bad news. He's found out that he's scheduled for, for being executed. So he really, really wants to escape. And Kashik says we can't because they, they will kill other people if we try to escape. And Jinex says, I could get... What could he get that would help them to escape? Yes. The commander's car. Yes. Not just any car. A Steyr 220 is the fastest car in Poland. Yeah? They'll never catch you if you're in a Steyr 220. But of course they can't just get in the car and drive it away. Can they? They'll be shot because they have to drive through the checkpoints and they'll be in their uniforms. They'll obviously be prisoners stealing a car. And so they have to be very clever. They go break into the uh, uniform store, they, they change into the uniforms, and then what else do they find as well as uniforms in that store that's so important? Yes, guns. So they take a gun each, but they don't load the guns. They just put one bullet. But why not have lots of bullets? Yes. So they only put one bullet in in case um, it all went wrong and they just wanted to kill themselves. That's right. But they didn't want to get into any kind of a shootout with the Nazis because for a start they'd definitely lose. It's millions of guards and only four of them. But for a second, if it should go wrong and they should hurt <coughs> a Nazi, what are the Nazis going to do? Yes. They're going to kill all the... Um I think first they're going to kill them, no. and then second they're going to kill all the other workers. They will do awful things to the other people in the camp to punish them. Yeah, so everyone's going to get punished, so they cannot have lots of, gut, lots of bullets, they've just got one each, yeah?